each course has a library guide assigned to it based on the course's prefix in Canvas. So in order to turn that on, you will go on the left-hand side all the way down to settings, choose navigation from the tabs at the top, and scroll down on the screen until you get to the list of items that are not enabled and click the three dots on the right-hand side to enable the tool. Then scroll down and press save. This will add a library resources tab over here on the left-hand side of your course. And when you click on that, it will embed the general library resources guide for your department. This is the library sandbox. So we have a generic guide since there's no prefix, but if your course has a specific prefix, it will be directed to library resources for, and it'll say your program and also the um, resources and librarian information over here will be specific to your program. Additionally, if you would like to add any library resources into your course as part of a module, you can click on the plus sign. Again, you'll um, change this drop down to external tool. You'll scroll down to library resources. And from here, you can choose any one of our guides, um, the full guide, a single page of the guide, or even just in also choose one of um, the other databases that we have in here, Films on Demand and um, EBSCO resources in general. So if you use any EBSCO databases in general, you can also embed those into your Canvas course so that your students don't have to leave the Canvas inter interface to go find something on the library's website. So if you wanted to add a video from Alex Street, you um, can just search right in here for um, whatever topic, and then you can um, choose that and it will be embedded. So hit add item and then here it is meditation music.